youth runner here with American Fork, standout Sky Jensen, who we can now call the Utah High School Activities Association 6A state champion. Sky, you've had you know the award ceremony, you've had the cool down or whatever. Uh, just what's what's foremost in your mind? What's 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 in your heart right now? Uh, I mean, that was an absolutely um, just master class and just the maturity that you showed in the early part of that race. But just like where where's the joy and the gratitude coming from right now? Um, it just feels good that I pushed it and gave it everything and did well. In, uh, in, in terms of just your patience and your composure early on, right? Like just running Sky Jensen's race, not worrying about, you know, what Maya or anybody else uh, w w was going to do. Like just how, how how important was it that you just, you stayed within yourself and just trusted, you know, in, in how you knew you could execute the second half of the race and what you, know, you and Bruno and, you know, and your support system had talked about ahead of time. How, how important was it just to kind of really remain calm early on regardless of what the gap was between the two of you? Um, just to make sure that I didn't go out too fast and just like kept calm so I could do well in the end and pick it up. How ex I mean, obviously you've you know, raced at the, at the complex last year, but uh, yeah. you know this is a course that favors you. It favors the entire American Fork program. Like yeah. when you got into mile two and mile three, like you know, were were you excited? You know, I mean, obviously, uh, you know, I guess you know a, a really old archaic analogy would be that cavemen have to hunt for you know for things, or cave women have to hunt for things, right? Like yeah. you were on the hunt at that point. Like did, did that challenge excite you in the last couple of miles? Yeah, it felt good. Awesome. Uh, and then obviously once. You, oh, once you had taken over, like, just what, what was that, uh, that 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 energy and that momentum, like, you know, propelling like that last that last K, that last 800, to, you know, to get to the finish line. Um, just that I can do it. Most definitely. Yeah. When when I had the blessing of speaking with you, you know, back at uh, at Timpanogos, uh, yeah. I mean, obviously, you know, you were, you know, very much. Uh, among the, uh, the elite athletes in the classification last year, so, some people graduated. Obviously, you and Maya have improved a, a lot. But I mean, yeah. did you believe even back like in August and, and September that you know if if I stay healthy, you know, and I run a really good race and I continue to progress, like was this some was this a goal of yours? Like, did you believe something like this could happen? Or yeah, yeah. So how, how much did that just kind of in those moments like where we only your teammates and Bruno get to see you train? Like, how much was that kind of like a silent motivation for you? How much did that drive you throughout the year? Um, it just helped knowing that I could actually do it and push hard. Awesome. And the fact that it's a, a reality, like just how, how sweet yeah. is it? It's just good. Awesome. Congratulations, Sky. Well Thanks. done.